Hi, my name is Barbara, and the book I put was Catcher in the Rye by J.D. Salinger. And I'm a little older, maybe, than some of the people that are going to do the band books. So I grew up in the 50s, and back in the 50s, uh, I don't think you could even say uh, hell in a book, and then it got banned. So when Catcher in the Rye popped up in 45, it just became extremely all the subject matter and the age of Holden and the swearing and, and the, the content, it was just like, oh my goodness, we can't read that. We can't have our children even near that. So of course, then it became very popular with us. You know, we were young adults, so to speak, and we were going to try and read anything that shouldn't have been read. Uh, on the plus side, I thought he was an excellent character. He probably was more realistic than uh, the other teenagers that we were reading about. You know, lovely little house on the prairie, everyone was wonderful and sweet and kind. And obviously Holden was not wonderful and sweet and kind. So um, I, I just thought it was, he was, he came to life. His swearing, his, his drinking, his smoking, that's what we, we all wanted to try out. So. This, why it was banned was uh, the times, and I don't say that all of the times were bad or good, but they should have been able to let the children decide for themselves with a little bit of guidance. I'll read just a little passage of the content that he you would ask, and he had no qualms about asking anybody intimate questions or because he wanted to know, and this is the passage. Uh, this young man, he meets this fellow called Luce, and the first thing he said when he sat down was that he could stay a couple of minutes. He said he had a date, and he ordered a dry martini. He told the bartender, make it very dry. Hey, he said, I got a flit for you at the end of the bar. Don't look now, but I've been saving it for you. Here again, the homosexuality content. Uh-oh, can't mention that. Very funny, he said, same old Caulfield, when are we going to grow up? I bought him a lot, I really did. He amused me, though he was one of those guys that sort of amused me a lot. How's your sex life, I asked him. Oh, even the word sex now, he can't use that in, in the books. He hated you to ask him stuff. Relax, sit back, for Christ's sake. There's the language again. Certainly, I like it. If I didn't like it, I wouldn't have gone there. Well, that's the content that it went, went back and forth between even intimating that it would be catcher, it would be uh, homosexual was, you know, and mentioning that you would even have an affair or even think of it or drinking. But I liked Holden and I read the book and I probably now will probably go back and read it again because probably I'll appreciate it more.